since we're screwing around, we want to talk about Butch. <laughs> I, I don't want to, but it, it needs to be talked about. This, I mean, oh, it's so bad. Just, oh, what are we doing? Can I? I'm going to say something. This might be the most controversial thing I've said on the show. That is terrifying. But, uh, I, I don't think Butch is that bad of a name. I only think it's bad because it's Pete Dunn. The name Butch is totally fine. If it was someone with no... If Rich Holland was called Butch, I'd like him more, honestly. <laughs> but it's because it's Pete Dunn. That's why it's bad. It's, it's because it's, it's someone who held a, a title for hundreds and hundreds of days and wrestled on the main roster, uh, you know, as a champion or whatever, and had a name that you're changing. But the name Butch is what I, it's only silly because it's on like Butch is better than Gunther, which is a normal name, but sounds bad because it's on a guy whose name was also a normal name. You know, like the naming and wrestling is so weird because it used to be like you just had you couldn't have a normal name, but the normal names became pretty standard, and now we're kind of we're in a weird in between space where you have to have a made up name, but then sometimes it sounds normal, sometimes it sounds fake or then someone like like Casey Catanzaro has a real name because it's a fucking who could think of a name like that that's not that doesn't even sound real like uh, the naming things is so weird but um I don't know about you guys but since I don't really watch NXT you know I've disconnected from my love for Pete Dunn you know that went out the window a few quite a few takeovers ago now are they even so called takeovers anymore? I don't even know. But uh, I'm not sure. So like this, I could just, I could just laugh at this, you know. I could, I could just laugh at this because at least, at least we know. Like, can we be disappointed if it's immediate? You know, like, can it really? T- isn't it better to just know right off the bat that you're stuck with fucking T Bar or Slapjack or Butch, you know, as opposed to. Ridge Holland, who has a boring ass name that's not even funny to laugh at, and you know you, you don't know where he's going. You just watch the slow, like I like assuming you cared about Ridge Holland in the first place. But uh, <laughs> yeah, I, like ah, fuck it, it's it's funny. It's almost objectively funny. It's it's just sad because it's Pete Dunn. If this was like anyone else, this would be the funniest fucking thing and i would borderline ironically love it it's literally and it's just because of the two matches of pete dunn i've seen live like that i'm like ah this sucks other than that i'm just like i can laugh at this all day fuck it butch the way he's dressed his name i love it it's terrible (laughs) that first point you very uh that you made was uh very he's out of line but he's right like (laughs) <laughs> yeah anybody else like coming up was named butch or like butch whatever like is cool you know because butch cassidy's cool but changing pete dunn's name to butch even with commentary trying to cover it being like oh seamus and ridge have called him butch for years like no it's stupid it's dumb it's pete that's pete fucking dunn the uh, these bastards had to change it because you're right danny everyone needs a made-up name now because WWE needs to make sure they own the trademark on it so when they leave, you know, they can't keep using that name and just drives with the fucking wall with these people. So tired of this nonsense, James. Fucking tired of it. You don't want to go to an indie show in, like, five years where it says, like, headlined by formerly known as Butch? That doesn't sound great to you? No. No. I, I know you were kidding. No. Fuck you. No. <laughs> Jesus. So, all right. To to just to lighten the mood. I, I This agree. was to lighten the mood, and I think yeah, it's I, 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 I think you are more <laughs> mad now than anything we had talked about earlier, which is concerning. But <laughs> I I think like maybe if Butch was like a first name, I'd be more okay with it. Like maybe if it was like for Ridge Holland, Bush Holland. 
it sounds like it's a stupid name, but at least it's a name. Maybe if it was Butch Dunn or Pete Butch, it would suck, but it would be better than just Butch. And I don't know. It, it, it's insulting because, as you guys said, they invested so much time into Pete Dunn. Like, we've watched him at takeovers. We've watched him in war games. We watched him on the main roster. We watched him win the the, NX, uh, the European, not European, oh my God, the UK title. I, I That was a blast <laughs> from the past. I am tired. Hopped in the um, time machine there for a yeah, second. <laughs> I just, I missed the European belt, if I'm being honest. It was very nice belt. Um, so it just feels insulting that they had us get that invested to then just be like, LOL, Butch. I don't know. I I, I hope Dunn, not because I'm not going to call him Butch. I'm no, not uh, either. I hope Dunn. Oh, 100% I'm calling him Butch all the time. <laughs> <laughs> He's going to bring up uh, Butch just for the sake of it. Like One... Nothing we'll be talking about has to do with it, but he'll, he'll make sure yes. he gets the name. Yeah, yeah, yeah. when Danny um, brings up Butch in every pod from here on out, finish your drink. <laughs> I... I, I, I know he's talented enough to make anything work in the ring. I don't know if how good he'll be making this character work. He looks like, compared to Seamus and Ridge, he looks like friggin' Tiny Tim. Like, it, it just, but I'm at a loss just because of how much I dislike it. But I... I like Pete Dunn a lot, and I'm going to support him despite the stupid name. Maybe I'll just chant Pete Dunn every time I'm, I see him live. I don't know. Yeah, I would say if we just ignored what WWE said and did what we wanted, they'd listen to us, but they never have. I don't know. They never will. This Once is, in a while. Yeah. But this is just like they added freaking to Seth Rollins' name. He's like literally listed as Seth freaking Rollins now. Because he called himself that a couple of times. Like, oh, branding. And then they say freaking like every 30 seconds. It's just, it's more of WWE's branding bullshit. And it just, it drives me nuts. And it's a huge reason why I don't watch the fucking shows anymore. Like, I'm not looking forward to watching WrestleMania. Strictly because I'm going to have to listen to Michael Cole and the, the uh, generic white guy from Raw yell like they're branding shit the entire time. I haven't even heard them say stupendous yet, and I'm not. I'm dreading it already. Like, Pat McAfee, thank you for, like, thinking of creative words, but they just took that and ran it into the ground 20 minutes. <laughs>